Hi, this is Kara from Darling Vulgarity. So I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different today. I'm gonna show you one of my favorite Selkie summer day dresses. It's not a Selkie day dress. It's just my favorite dress to wear <laughs> during the day in the summertime. And then I'm gonna show you my favorite Selkie dress to wear at night in the summertime. And I will show you how I style both of them. This is the Selkie Kiera dress in La Fraise. It came out last summer. The print is this really cute little strawberry print. And then the lining is in the summer home print. I just loved that it wasn't a plain white lining or a solid lining. I really love this dress. I wore it for my birthday last year. I think it's super flattering. It has the corset bodice. It has lined cups, so you really don't need to wear a bra with it. Um, I am wearing a long line bra with it right now because I think it makes the dress look a little more flattering, but I've worn it before with nothing underneath and it was totally fine. It's not see-through, it's totally opaque. It has the nice puff sleeves. It's 100% cotton, which is one of the reasons it is my favorite dress to wear during the day in the summertime because it's short and breathable. One of my favorite things was these bustles. It's like, I love all the bustling in the Selkie gowns, but how often do I really need to wear a gown? And I loved that the Kiera dress has it in the short form in a more casual style. So you can see how it's bustled here in the front on both sides. And while it has the option to bustle in the back, the button for the bustle on this side ripped off. I either need to fix it myself or get it fixed, but now I can't wear the bustles in the back. So I'm kind of bummed about that and kind of bummed that it came off so easily when I haven't worn the dress that many times. Not a difficult fix. I love this dress. I would never get rid of it. So let me show you what I style it with. You don't really need to do much to style this dress. The hard part is kind of done for you. It has a structured bodice. It has these cute dramatic sleeves. It has cups. It has the bustling and the petticoat built in. If you do want to style it though and just mix it up a little bit, um, I like putting the soft corset with it. This Kiera dress comes in a few different colors and prints. I especially like adding the soft corset that matches whatever the petticoat is. So maybe you left the house and you were feeling really great in this dress and now throughout the course of the day you've ended up somewhere where you're feeling really overdressed and you need to tone it down pronto. Putting a baby tee over top of this dress totally works. You can sort of pull the sleeves down so that they're almost like the cuff of the t-shirt. It covers up the decollete and add, makes it a little more modest and casual. And as long as it's in the same color scheme, it might seem like a strange pairing, but I love the juxtaposition. If you've watched any of my other videos, you know that I love throwing jean jackets over things, so I'm not even gonna show you that. Obviously, you can throw a denim jacket over this dress and it's gonna look perfection. Another thing you could do, and I kind of like the masculine element that this uh, brings to it, is take a white button-up collared shirt, almost that looks like a big boyfriend blouse, and tie it over top. You could also do this with a denim shirt, depending on which Kiera print dress you have. With this one, I think the white top looks good. With some of the other prints, maybe a black top or the denim top would look better or even a pink top. Just something that buttons up that you could tie at the waist. Because you don't wanna lose the accentuation of the waist and you definitely don't wanna lose the bustling here. This does add a little bit of casual cool to it and it can also add a little bit of warmth if the sun is going down and you still want to wear your dress but it's getting a little chilly. This is the Renaissance dress in caviar which is a true blue black. This is my favorite summer night's dress. It has a similar silhouette to the Kiara dress in that there's a corseted bodice and underwire cups. It has the same puffed sleeves. It zips up the back just like the Kiara dress does and like the Kiara dress, it is 100% cotton and it is very long. I'm five foot four and I need to wear pretty 
major heels for this not to drag on the ground. The Kiara dress was an extra large. This one, the Renaissance dress, is an extra, extra large. There's not a whole lot of difference in those two sizes for me. For my body type, those two are pretty interchangeable. And again, I'm a US size 14 normally. Like the Kiara, this is a dress that can be worn all on its own. It needs very little styling to look good, if any at all. But I am gonna show you a few different layering options. It's like fashion tools for your toolbox. I love this jacket, it's by Free People. It's a snakeskin denim print and it just gives me Nicolas Cage in Wild at Heart vibes. I love it with this long black dress. You don't wanna cover up the bodice, I wouldn't button it. If I were to just close this jacket up completely, I'm basically a big straight line. If it's a longer jacket like this one, I would just say leave it unbuttoned, or you could even wear it a little more dramatically off your shoulders like this. Styling option number two is to wear a just a little bolero with it. This is a black one because I love the all black look. You could also wear something that's a different color. I would just make sure it's not a skin tight bolero because you do need to tuck the puff sleeve into the bolero to make it work and keep yourself a few degrees warmer. Lastly, if it is legit cold outside and you really should be wearing long sleeves, but instead you've chosen to wear a cotton sulky dress, number one, good for you. Number two, throw a leather jacket over top, like either a bomber or a motorcycle jacket. This is a vintage fringe, super 80s high shoulders <laughs> jacket. And I do like the black on black look that I get when I wear it with this dress. But really, any leather jacket will do. Those are my favorite summer day and summer night outfits. Leave me a comment. Let me know what your favorite summer selkie items are. Let's share ideas. Thanks.